Hey, hey, Samantha Pointer here with Get It Together. And today I wanted to show you a new tech tool that I'm using to stay organized in my business. And I wanted to share it with you and it's called Airtable. So basically Airtable is like if Excel and, oh, I don't know. <laughs> I really don't, if Excel, Google Form, if all of those great Word documents, everything had a baby, it would be Airtable. It is like Excel on steroids. So what I'm showing you here is just, uh, they have what you call workspaces. So I have a personal workspace and then I have my business workspace. So for my business workspace, I have created what they call tables and, uh, uh, well bases and so my first base is the master content list now what I keep in here and I'm gonna click through to it what I keep in here is actually um, just my information uh, all all the content I want to write topics headlines courses I want to make opt-in ideas I, you know, I used to keep this in several different places. Um, one of which is Evernote. I have the majority of my stuff in, in Evernote, but, uh, when I got to writing down some, uh, other like topics and headlines, I would usually just stick it in wherever I was at the time, which would, you know, be my iPhone notes and then transfer it over later. Well, in here I can see everything. So I have my blog these are all blog posts that have been uh, posted already. Uh, I keep a link of all that. So, you know, for easy sharing and everything. And then I just have a list of topics I might want to talk about. Um, and I'm able to do notes, attachments, keywords, platform use. I got my headlines uh, that I want to use, any opt-in ideas, any reviews I want to write. Uh, it's just all right here. Um, any programs, it's all right here. So that's what I'm loving about Airtable. Also, you can keep up with your brand. So I have my affiliate links, my bit.ly links. You can keep your logos, any of your coupon codes, anything of that nature. Uh, my standard operating procedures. So I have systems that I use in my business, uh, my training websites that I go to and need to keep up with. All that is right here in Airtable. And because they have a um, an app on your phone or on your tablet, I can quickly enter in information there. Now, the great thing about this, and let me go back over here to my content, is if you want to see this in different views, you can. So you can look at this in a form view. If it's in form view, you'll be able to populate everything through a form like Google Forms. Uh, same kind of layout, only it populates it and then you can view it as like kind of how it is now, like an Excel view or grid view, or you can view this as a calendar, which is great if you're using this to put in content you're writing for your business, you can actually, if you put dates on things and do calendar view, now you have a, a built-in editorial calendar. You can look at it in gallery view or Kanban if you like the kind of Trello where you can drag and drop from uh, one, one area to the next, like if you have to do, to doing and done, uh, that's what the Kanban view is. So there's a lot you can do with this. Now I'm on the free version. Uh, you get a lot for the free version and you can add even more things if you want to upgrade to their paid version. They also have built in templates if you don't know where to start. Um, and it, you know, it's just based on what you need and what you can do is, uh, click on a template you want to use, hit use template, and it's already pre-populated. So what you can do is just erase out anything you don't need and put in your stuff. And that way you're not starting for, from scratch. So that is Airtable. Um, 
I will drop in the comments where you can go and get it uh, with my invite code. And yeah, check it out. If you're a fan of Excel, if you're a fan of spreadsheets and databases like Access and things like that, you're going to uh, want to check out Airtable.